1989, five African American and Latino teenagers were arrested for beating and raping a white woman in New York City's Central Park. They became known as the Central Park Five. The teenagers initially confessed, I put that in quotes, but soon recanted, insisting they had admitted to the crime under the duress of exhaustion and coercion from police officers. Um, this is a clip of 13th. Last night, the 18s accused in the attack were arraigned on charges of rape and attempted murder. In the Central Park Jagger case, they put five innocent teens in prison because the public pressure to lock up these quote-unquote animals was so strong. You better believe that I hate the people that took this girl and raped her brutally. You better believe it. Donald Trump wanted to give these kids a death penalty, and he took out a full-page ad to put the pressure on. These children, four of them under 18, all went to adult prisons for 6 to 11 years before DNA evidence proved they were all innocent. So that's a clip from 13th, the Central Park Five. Uh, the city of New York just reached a multi-million dollar settlement with them. But Donald Trump continues to say that they're guilty, Ava DuVernay. Well, I mean, this is the atmosphere uh, of Trump. It's it's um, it is dangerous. It is from no no basis of fact. It's completely fabricated to continue to uh, you know demonize these men after they've been found not guilty after they, after they've been you know awarded losses by by the city. Um, it's it's stunning, but it's to be expected at this point, and it's something that we need to start to understand is going to be the new normal. And so, folks, especially artists, the community that I um, am a part of, really have to be diligent and rigorous in our opposition to it through our work.